All right, ladies and gents, what's happening? It's the rap throwback, and we're back for another uh, album reveal. Or, so, uh, you know, some sort of reveal. But some kind of retrospect. Yeah, you know, we've got a couple of Ice Cube LPs we want to go over, but uh, got Diz up in the house. What's up? And uh, I'm your boy uh, Soundwave, Dre 40 Ounce. Uh, so today we have Ice Cube, Warm Peace, Volumes 1 and 2. So we've got uh, volume one here. And, That's volume. Uh, yeah, that is volume one, right? We've got war. Volume two here. So yeah, peace. war and peace. So the war disc and the peace disc, or record. These In came out at separate times. They they didn't come out at the same time. Right, right. Yeah. So and there was quite there was a good gap in between the two, right? Like, yeah, it was like a year or two. I think it, it was like, like two years. Yeah, it was a while. Um, I don't remember why that was, um, but regardless, we we have a volume one and two here, and to me, they were two very different albums. Yeah, completely. Um, but uh, Diz picked these up at uh, Recycled Records in Longmont. That's right. Found it in Longmont, Colorado. Right on. So, uh, shit, let's just get to it, huh? Yeah, let's check it out. All right, so here we have volume one the war disc uh so that's the cover right there what's up with that sticker there that respect the classics death jam party interscope and virgin with the website okay so they're like repressing these or something yeah so yeah they must be repressing them because uh how would they know it was a classic right damn right uh but yeah cool man so these are all in the plastic all brand new so let's open this bad boy up. All right, let's see. Nothing like opening a brand new album. Bam. All right, so here we go. Uh, You guys saw the cover already. Uh, Here's a look at the back of the record. Let's Um, get a good look on these guys. Yeah, so you got a couple of uh, pictures back there. Yeah, we got Show Chop here. Yeah. Um, You know, it's cool. It it, uh, also, uh, it doesn't really give you producer credits on the back, but, you know, it just tells you who's featured on it and the timing of each one, um, which is kind of cool. Not exactly like a CD, but, you know. Pretty yeah. close, right? The back is kind of like what you would get on a CD insert. Yeah, so we got a couple pictures here, you know. Ice Cube here in, in the camo. Ice Cube looking sharp and Ice Cube and Chop. Let's just see. Whatever happened to you, Chop? That's a great question. I, I believe he came out with one album and then uh, I don't think yeah. I heard from him again. And then on the lower left here, we got uh, Ice Cube there with his top hat yeah. produced by Ice Cube. Some other info there. All right, it's cool. But then on the lower right here, we have like a city burning. And then we actually have some really little text here. And I think this might be where it tells us everything that who produced everything. So so the, the cool thing about this record is that... Uh, It doesn't have that fuzzy looking image because the first album was a 3D cover. Uh, So that was a little weird looking when you would take the insert out. It was all blurry and shit because you had the 3D uh, cover on the top. Yeah, that that funky fake 3D shit. Yeah, Yeah, I wasn't a big fan of that. Don't know why Cube did that. Yeah, he didn't do it for the Peace album, so he must have got think, the memo. Yeah, I think he got the idea that that probably was not the best idea. But one last look at the front here before we get to the inside. Yep, nice, so, nice, nice and clear. Let's see how many records we have here. It looks like two. So uh, we've got A, B, C, and D sides. So the A side, we have Ice Cube uh, with the uh, face paint and four tracks. Let's take a look at that bad boy. 
<laughs> that's pretty dope. Yeah. Um, let's see if this uh, record has... There we go. Let's see. Nice. And then the B side, pretty simple. Just the text with the uh, next Got four, that four lin- tracks. And that Lynch Mob logo on there. Yeah. Let's take a look at that bad boy. The Lynch Mob. I wonder if he's still re- releasing his stuff under the Lynch Mob. I think he does. Yeah, that's dope. So that's the A and B side there. Pretty nice. And here we go back to the C side, and we have another picture of Ice Cube shooting a lightning bolt through his eye. No way. Let me see that. Damn, that's tight. Embracing his inner Raiden. Yeah, he is. So uh, C, side C, and then we have side D with uh, another basic like side B. Dope, man. uh, So the record fit on two vinyls. Yeah, uh, and most LPs will come on two. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, this is pretty sweet, man. Uh, these two labels are placed on the record the same. Yeah. The other one was a little skewed, but that's cool, man. I like it. It's dope. It looks pretty dope. All right, let's get this guy back in the sleeve, and we'll uh, pull out the piece disc for volume two. Volume dose. All right. So here we go. Peace disc. Here's a look at the cover. Just ice cube. Kind of looks like you might be yelling or something. Maybe getting amped up for war. Yep. Well, this is peace. Should have a happy face. Cube Just don't. <laughs> cube don't make happy faces, man. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Even when he smiles, he looks mad. All right, let's get a better look at that there. So we got that track listing there. Dr. Dre, MC Ren. Hell yeah. Right at the start, buddy. NWA right out of the gate. Yep. Some uh, some other cool graphics here. Did you have the CD? I think I had the CD. I don't think I had this one. I had the war disc, but I don't think I ended up getting peace. I think I got peace for that NWA song. I, I don't know. I really liked War, and then I think I heard Peace when you got it. Yeah. And it just, I don't know, for whatever reason, that record didn't really, uh, you know, didn't I didn't catch on to it too much. Yeah, yeah. It was way different than War, so I was it expecting was. more uh, more music like the War disc. Let's see. We got some text here at the bottom here. It's really just the production credits and all that good shit. Nice to see a little squeak roo on there. Nice. Oh, I forgot Crazy Bone was on this record. Yep. Miss Toy and Mac 10. Yeah, and the Crazy Bone track ended up being the radio single, I believe. It was. That song was all over the radio for a while. Let's see if anything else sticks out here. Um, Doesn't look like it, you know. Just the good old credits here, but uh, the features that stick out really are, you know, Crazy Bone. And, of course, Dr. Dre and MC Ren. Miss Toy, you know, she didn't really do a lot, but it's crazy that she made it to this Cube record. Right. And what song was she, was she on on this album? Um, Isn't it You Can... No, that's Players that was, Club. That was War. Yeah, it is. It's You Can Do It. That's oh. the one you can, isn't that you can do it, put your back into it? That's yeah. the one I'm thinking of. Is that Players Club, though? No, I thought that was on the War Disc. I think it's on the Peace Disc. It must be this one right here. Oh, huh, crazy. Yeah. Okay. Push and Wait was the big one on the War Disc. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So, yeah, that's crazy. That's cool. All right. Then uh, another quick look at the front without the plastic. Did he have a video for that song with Toy and Mac-10? I feel like he might have. I think he did. And I think uh, the Crazy Bone song had a, a video, too. It's cool, man. It's a dope cover. 
All right. Still using the same ice cube font. Yeah, it's a dope font. So let's go ahead and pull these records out and see what we got. So same thing, two discs, A, B, C, and D. Do they get creative with the, the graphics on here? Uh, you know, it's a little bit more creative than the war disc, but uh, we have smaller pictures. So let's take this out here. This is the A side. All right. All right. Cool. And then uh, the B side has Ice Cube. Looks like he's uh, going to eat his finger. He must be thinking really hard. Yeah. So there's A and B there. Nice. And then here we got C. Uh, looks like Ice Cube resembles a mugshot. Yep. And then the D side, we have a similar shot, only from further away. Let me see if I can. There we go. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. So. I think I like the volume one graphics better. Yeah, me too. I don't um, really dig the thumbnails on here. No, it's, they are too small for sure. But, uh, well, shit, might as well uh, let's see if we can't get a shot of uh, at least the pictures. See, this is C, so I'll put that over here. Well, actually, never mind. Here we go. It doesn't matter. We've got uh, B side here, D side there for uh, or the piece disc, and then we've got A and C over here. Pretty dope. Pretty dope, man. I used to spin records back in the day. Would have been cool to have this one. Yeah, pretty dope. Cool, let's get these, uh, we'll just put the LPs next to each other for dramatic effect. Let's do that. Volume one, volume two. Pretty dope. Ice Cube dropping a two volume set. So this was 95. And this one is 2000? This can't be 95. This was like 98. Let me see. I got my Lokes on. Yep, 98. And this one was 2000. <laughs> and that one was 2000. So it was like a two year difference yeah, it was a between two year the two. Difference. Yeah, I was going to be like, what? Five years? No way. Yeah. So. That's dope. Hold them up together and then we out. There we go. Well, there you have it, folks. War and Peace, the vinyls. Pretty sweet, man. Dope shit, man. Go get you a physical copy, man. You don't get this shit downloading uh, the digital stuff or streaming you know this is what's missing yeah man you know these are little treasures man they're dope yeah you know i wish the digital platforms would allow you to upload a, a booklet I, I i know uh itunes was experimenting with that back they used in the day to. yeah but uh not anymore no i mean i guess it's more work for the artist to have to do that but i mean if they're providing a physical copy it's a simple upload it seems like it's dope shit, man. Yeah, man. This is the shit. Going through it, looking at the credits, pictures, all that stuff while you're listening to the record. Yep. Right on. War and peace, baby. This all is right. the rap throwback. Peace. Peace out. <laughs>